Yeah. 45 rounds uh, of the ammunition inside the tank, so nine inside the turret and another 18 in two, on, in two um, sponsons, so um, 18 on each side. Notionally capable of um, 20 rounds a minute, so yeah. that's, um, that's all over quick. very quick. <laughs> yeah, and uh, so quick firing. The turret could traverse in 24 seconds. Uh, so yeah, power assisted traverse. Yeah, power assisted traverse. 160k range on road. Uh, slightly and it was slightly cheaper than the Sherman. As I say, it's um, um, but they probably wanted it cheaper. It was one of the uh, ideas was that it was going to be a cheaper vehicle, but it was slightly cheaper than, than the Sherman, but not as cheap as they probably. But in like. terms of essential resources being the cannon and the engine, it was basically, and this is where the criticism of the concept comes in eating up the same um, resources pipeline as the Sherman. Yes, but they also provided uh, a lot of commonality. And, and, yeah. and it was built in a different factory, and, and yeah, we're going to get into a lot of the pros and cons there. Yeah. Now, let's talk about your doctrine, John. Yes. So, um, the Americans, at the particularly in 1940, looked at what the Germans had been doing um, and said, um, my God, we need something that can counter a uh, massive armoured thrust uh, as, you know, particularly had occurred in France, but also Poland, also to some extent in Spain. 